everybody. I'm leaving you a small little video. I'm on my break at work. I just wanted to say hi and welcome you to the last weekend before Christmas. I hope you're all safe. And if you're running around doing shopping, please be careful. I know there's a big football game in my, um, well, not in my area, but my team, my hometown team, the Buffalo Bills, are down in Foxborough trying to beat the New York or the New England Patriots. Um, so I know there's a lot of people at bars right now partying. I hope we can win just to prove that we can do it. But there'll probably be a lot of drunk drivers out tonight. So wherever you are, whether you're shopping or partying, please be careful because you know how reckless people can be. Um, just wanted to say hi to you guys. A little update. My good friend Laura, she surprised me and sent me, gave me a ticket and we went to see the Star Wars uh, Rise of Skywalker last night. I won't give any spoilers out, but it was great. I think J.J. Abrams did a really great job. Uh, my friend was telling me there were some bad reviews on it, but I don't really give much thought into reviews. Um, I think I was totally satisfied. I hope that George Lucas was satisfied that his creation had a nice ending. Um, it was fun to get out. We went during the day where my anxiety is much better during the day. It was um, a smaller movie theater, so there weren't too many people. And we had lunch, and it was really nice to talk. Uh, Laura is a really good friend of mine. She's a godsend. We actually met each other at work um, about 12 years ago. And like I may have mentioned in previous videos, sorry for the traffic noise in the background. I work on a busy street. It's really hard to find friends when you become an adult. And I think that's why we cherish our friendship so much. Um, we're opposites in a lot of ways, but she has such a heart of gold. And I thank God for putting her in my path. I also wanted to give a shout out to my friend Shirley, who successfully had her cancer, sur cancer removal surgery. I know that she was quite worried. Um, I know that she suffers with complex PTSD. And I just wanted to say, I'm so happy you made it out of surgery. I love you very much. I'm praying for you to have a smooth recovery. And I pray that the doctors got it all out. And just put all your trust in God, my dear. To all of you, I hope you're as prepared for Christmas as you're going to be. I hope you don't spend more than you have. Just remember the true meaning of Christmas and to know that when you're giving, it's best to give from your heart. It's not about the quantity, it's about the quality. And no matter if you're making a gift or you're buying a gift, as long as the thought comes from your heart and you're giving for the right reasons, you can't possibly go wrong. So that's all about the time I have right now. But I just wanted to stop by and say hey to you. I promise I'm going to get back to making longer videos soon, but I just wanted to take a break. It's a very nice night. I'm actually out here in just my sweater without my jacket on, so it's nice. Unfortunately, I'm not going to have a white Christmas in my area, but I know there's storms around in lots of areas, so I can consider myself lucky. So I'm just going to continue my break, finish my cup of coffee, and go back to work. Um, my pain injection in my back really didn't go as well as I hoped. I've never had it not work for me, but this time, unfortunately, it didn't work. I'm going to be optimistic about it and give it the full week to see if I get any benefits from it, but I, so far I haven't. Um, my Social Security case is going to be up for um, a hearing again sometime soon, and it looks like in the next two to six months I'll get a answer one way or the other. My case has been going since 2014. So right now I've been bombarded with lots of um, mail and um, lawyers calling me for interviews and going for doctor's appointments. And it's really down to crunch time. So it's all in God's hands, but I really hope that it works out for the best. I don't know what more I can do, so I'm just going to let go and let God. But I promise to keep you guys all updated and I promise to keep smiling through it all. Making videos is so good for my anxiety because normally my anxiety prevents me from opening up. But when I get behind this camera and I know I'm talking to people that like me and care about what I have to say, 
it puts me at ease. So I just want to thank you for taking the time to listen to me. I'm sorry if the camera's shaking. I hope this video finds you well. And until I talk to you all again, you take care. Bye.